Okay, I didn't make it to the flea market today. Um, it's like November 2nd. Yes. So, it's actually a, a balmy morning. It's actually not too bad. So I figured I'd click. She's not behind me. People are crazy talking to my phone. They probably think I'm just recording the sun. There won't be as many vendors this time of year. There's still a few people and I thought, well, if I can get a little video out of it and see some cool things, why not? It's gonna be like 60 today. It's not too bad. Put a few table set up, so we'll just see what's here. Why they have to be so contrary, I don't know, but yeah, anyhow. Hello. Hi, morning. <laughs> Thank you. 
Bucks, guys. Stuff is full. Oh, 
bucks for five bucks, guys. Stuff it full. Back here, if anyone needs them. Thank you, dear. Fill the box, five bucks, guys. Stuff is full. Five bucks, guys. Stuff it with whatever you want, as much as you want. You can lift it, you can have it. Hi, how you doing? Hi, morning. How are you? Okay, great, thank you. And um, they took care of it, but with my dog getting a little bit better quality. A lot of people have to say. Half off the price.
That's a four in No, I'm not that. I said go back to the bank and check it at all. Ladies are a hundred. A lady got a counterfeit out of a out of a bank a hundred dollars. Again? She got a counterfeit hundred out of a bank. Yeah. 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 Oh, that's right, we did our audio.
an absorbent amount of money put in, and I'm like, yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, I, I, I say I collect, I collect firms in green gear or something. <laughs> Those are cool. I've seen these were for a long time. <laughs>
Alrighty, ready to see the stuff that I got? I did really, really well. Um, the one place that I was in, I don't know if you could hear it, but the guy was getting rid of everything. You could fill a box for $5. Like, every item was a dollar or less, and then you could fill a box for $5. I've seen this guy there before, and back when I was doing eBay, I would just, like, load up with stuff. I just... It's a great place if you're an eBay seller or you have a little vintage booth. Uh, so, but as I don't, I didn't go too crazy, but I did fill a box and all the boxes were the same size. Some were like short and some were really tall. And the box I grabbed was, I will show you. I grabbed this box. You can see, ooh, it's full of stuff. And I, I first only found a couple things that I liked, so I figured I'll just, I'll just get those. But as I was walking around, I found a few more items. I'm like, gosh darn it, I'll just go get a box and fill it with stuff. And whatever I don't want, I'll give away. I think for $5, if I get 10 things, it's like 50 cents per thing. And, you know, no big deal. So I fill it with a bunch of stuff. And I go over to the guy and I'm like, oh, I set my box down to pull my, my wallet, and he's like, oh, you got a small box there. It really wasn't. It was just shorter. Some of the boxes were just taller. He's like, oh, you kind of looked over everything in my box. He's like, oh, I'll do three. Three dollars. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> so I got a box full of stuff for three dollars, so I will show you here in a second. But So I was really excited about that. That was, that was fun. So... I filled up my box, paid for it, and then I had to walk it back to my car because it was just so heavy, too heavy. Like, I didn't want to carry it around while I was trying to shop. So, I got some footage of, of the flea market. Um, I didn't get a whole lot. I, there was actually, It was pretty full today, but I was just, after a while, I just start to get, I was kind of had a kink in my neck from constantly looking down at boxes and tables and then trying to record as well. So, I'm not sure how long this video is going to be. Um, it may not be very, very long. I don't know. But I have a good haul at the end, so that's got to be worth something. But anyway, um, sorry, I'm feeling a little off today, a little brain scattered. I'm working on another video and a piece of furniture, and I'm going to try and get that one actually up first. So this video will probably come up second, I think. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. So I'm a little, like, scatterbrained today, so I'm apologizing, or I'm sorry for I'm apologizing. Of course I'm apologizing. <laughs> I'm leaving that in. I'm leaving that in. Anyway. Slow down. Get yourselves together. Like my dad used to say that to me when I was a kid. If I was if I was talking too fast and I'd stumble over my words or, or whatever, because my thoughts are already five miles down the road and my mouth cannot keep up. And my dad would be like, "Slow down. Think about what you want to say." And I can still hear him now. Slow down. Just think about it. Okay. Gotta find his end moment here. All right. Well, let's just dive into the box, not figuratively, because that would be painful. But um. I don't know how many items I got. Like, I didn't count them. I like to go in orders. I found them, but that's... My, my brain likes to be, like, in order. But um, I got a couple of rice bowls. This is one that I got. It's actually a good size. I have one exactly like this, but it's smaller. And I don't know if you can tell, but you can see through... No, you can't tell in the sliding. There's these little... Oh, you can see, like, this little bit. These little holes in it. Not holes, but the light goes through. These little tiny specks. So that's kind of fun, and it's, I love it because I have a smaller one exactly like it. And my smaller one actually has a chip in it. Ugh, this stuff is filthy. It's so dirty. Um, so that was one. I really should count them as I go because I have no idea how many things I have. I got this pink glass bowl. 
I got this for my mom if she wants it. If she doesn't want it, I'll just donate to Goodwill or give it away to somebody else. But she loves the Depression pink glass. And this is really pretty. It's a good size. I don't know if she has this one or not. I've picked her up. I've picked up stuff for her several times in the past, but I don't remember what I've gotten for her. And uh, so that's something. That's two bowls. And then randomly, I saw this book earlier. Oh, sorry. I just realized my uh, camera's flipped. It says the King's, the King's Wish. So it's obviously it's going to be backwards, but it stinks. Oh my gosh. It smells like stink bugs. <laughs> I said doctor, it was a Dr. Seuss, well, had the, not the Dr. Seuss, but it had the little cat thing on it, and I wasn't sure who it was written by, and I've never seen it before, so I thought, I'm going to show you some of the pictures. Again, the writing's going to be backwards, and I'm, I'm sorry. But I have no idea, ew! Oh my gosh, ew, look. Ew, no wonder it smells like stink bug. <laughs> That's so gross, ew, it's a dead stink bug. <laughs> Look, they all, di they all died from the smell of the stink bug. They're done. <laughs> That's funny. Anyway, so I got that little book. I'm going to have to clean that up. I might just throw that away. That's kind of gross. Um, let's see, what else did I get? I see these little things all the time, and I never pick them up. But I figured I've never bought one before, so now I can say I bought one. I don't see any chips or problems with it. It says made in Japan. I will show you, even though it's backwards. But there she is. Some nice little... Well, maybe I use it for a little creamer or something. Oh, you know what might be fun? Um, since he looks like a pirate, like maybe do like rum or something in it. Looks sticky. Why is it sticky? I don't know. I wish you didn't see these in antique stores. I never got the, the interest in them, but eh, I grabbed it just to have it. <laughs> Again, here's something with wording, and it will be backwards. I'll read it ahead of time. Oh, sorry, I guess I'm sitting on my ankles. Um, you will always find hugs and kisses here. And this big old plaque. I don't know if it's ceramic or terracotta. Couldn't it looks like terracotta. But I've never seen anything like it. I just, just thought it was really pretty. I don't know where I'm gonna put it. And there's nothing written on the back. Oh no, I lied. My hand was in the way. I lied. It says uh a something like Serpia oh, 2008, so it's not even old. It looks old though, but it's really cool. It's really pretty. I like it. All right, put this over here on top of the stinky book. Oh, oh, this dust. Oh, it's in my nose. Got this really neat old amber bottle. It says Clover's Imperial Mange Medicine. Mange isn't that for dogs. Anyway, see the lettering. You see how dirty all this stuff is. Nice little amber bottle. It's pretty, it's pretty in a windowsill. Put like a flower in it. Look really pretty with the sun coming through. All right, there's that. Oh, this is one item that I picked up on camera. It's this lovely little. I have this thing for stained glass, like or sun catchers. I have a bunch of them. I was trying to sell them, but I might just end up keeping them because I do like them. I just don't know where to put them. Isn't that darling. And that. Find a better place to sit. I'm sitting with one ankle, so I have to keep readjusting here. Oh, let me sit back. You won't see as much of my head, but I don't really matter in this video, anyways. This is the hall, so it gives me this whole section up here. This whole section to show you all this stuff. Oh, this is the first bowl, the first thing that I grabbed. I love a good rice bowl. Wait, what does it say? Um, gold Amari hand painted, and then there's it looks like some kind of Asian symbol. And of course, it's gonna be backwards, so it's not gonna help me or you. But I just thought that was really pretty. The inside's kind of gold ish. Not pretty. I just feel like it's got these birds on it. That is really pretty. These are so fun to eat ramen in, or like if we get Chinese food, stick it in here. So, I gotta clean those out. Most of my rice bowls are the little small ones. These are a little bit bigger, so that's nice. I snagged this. At first, I thought this was in its original packaging, but now that I'm looking at it, I'm not sure that it is. But I like the little wooden pineapples. It even has a little wooden spoon. I've seen these little wooden pineapples and stuff in thrift stores all the time, but I've never seen a little wooden spoon. So again, I have no idea what I'm going to do with it, but I've never seen them. I think it's original packaging because it has a little plastic flower in it. I'm smelling something. 
All right. Oh, this was cool too. I can always use, I guess you would call this like a cake spatula or I'm not sure, but I think it's Bakelite. I actually have a knife that I got at the flea market a while back. It has this exact same, oh, maybe it's not auction, the exact same handle. I'm pretty sure it just has stainless steel on it, but I can always use something like that. That's cool. And that's this little plaque, Jesus never fails. Just a little encouragement. Again, it's backwards. It's just a little verse that says, I will never leave thee nor forsake thee. I thought that was sweet. Very nice. Oh, and the other pink glass that I got from my mom, just a little sugar bowl. It matches the bowl, the bigger bowl that I got. But it doesn't have a lid, unfortunately. That's right. And the last thing in the box, again, I don't know why I grabbed this. I'm not a huge fan of red, but it was just this pretty red glass goblet. No markings. But with Christmas around the corner, it might be really pretty with a votive candle on it. Stick in the bathroom or something. So, And it feels really nice. Like, it's a nice glass feel. All right, I want to count the items real quick. So, one... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So thirteen. I got thirteen things for three dollars. Woo! Very nice. Actually, I don't want to put the pink glass back in there because I'm gonna see my mom tonight, so I'm gonna get this stuff to her. Ooh, is it a crack? No, okay. So putting these aside for mother. Cause she's a deer. And then I got a couple other things when I was walking around. Oh, oh sorry, my nose. The other thing I have to go into, I, have to, I put it in my wallet because it's really, really small. You might have seen it on the footage, but I didn't pick it up while I was filming. I had to put my change. Where is that? Here we go. It's really tiny, but it's beautiful. Let's zip this up or else my coins are going to go flying all over my purse. All right. Hope this picks up. It's and it, it, I'm pretty sure it's sterling silver because I can see the letters S T E and it's wore off. So I'm pretty sure this is sterling silver. It's actual silver. It's a darling little. Where's my camera? Can't thou see it? Can the frame go down? There you go. There you go. No! You had it. Anyway, it's a little Art Nouveau lady head. There we go. Can't get my face out of it. At first I thought it was a pendant. I wasn't thinking about it when I bought it, but after I bought it, I'm like, it's so teeny tiny. That's a charm, Holly. That is not a pendant. Isn't that pretty? I don't know if you can see the STE. Look. It's by like where her ear would be. Can I see a little bit? So I got that for $5, which I didn't think was too bad. For sterling silver, I don't know if it's really that old, but she just looked Art Nouveau to me, so. Here's the story. Last thing I got, you probably laugh when you see this, but I just thought it was so cute. This darling little elephant. An elephant. I gotta clean up some of this paper stuff that's like stuck on. Actually, it might just come right off. I'll get some other like, good lightly damp paper towel. It's <laughs> alright, nothing broke. <laughs> it's knocked over my mom's bowls. It's not that came right off. Unfortunately, it does have a little torn spot down here, but if I display it like this, you won't even see it. So it's okay. I have another little vinyl elephant, uh, one of my shelves out in the living room. And I actually have been kind of wanting to get another little vinyl stuffed toy. I just think they're so darling. They're so cute. I actually was looking on eBay over the weekend. I made a huge list of watched items and they all were like these little, these little ones. I love the elephants. Like, oh, look at the eyes, look at the ears, sorry. I'll show you that. And one of them that I was watching had two, two of these in it. I think one was almost this one exactly. It was really cute. Um, I said they're so adorable, and I just like elephants. They're sweet. So, isn't that cute? And the darlings. So, a little wet. So, that was it for the finds. There was a lot of other interesting stuff, but I didn't want to go too crazy. Got some wear in between the lines there, too. I don't know if you can see here. It's like, I wish, I couldn't tell if it was ripped at first. It's just worn. I don't want to, like, rip it further. But, um, so yeah, that was, that's today's haul. So was it 13, 14, 13, 14, 15, 15 items, 13 of them were like $3 for the whole thing. So that was a good, that was a good deal. I'm happy with that. So 
I feel like there was something else I was going to share, but I guess not. That's that. We'll just we'll call it here. That's all it needs to be. Uh, so just thank you for watching. Um, this will probably be a shorter video. I mean, I'm already about 14 minutes in. This is just me talking. So I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed kind of walking around with me a little bit. The flea market. It's always fun to go over there. I actually, I really didn't feel like going out today, but I knew I had to head to the grocery store and it was out that way. So I figured it'd be good for me to go out and walk around and I didn't sleep well last night. So I wasn't sure how energetic I would feel. So I did my walking around, I hit the grocery store and then I came back home and I like took a nap, <laughs> got up, had lunch. It's that kind of a day. So it's actually gorgeous to all this fresh air. It's just, it knocks me out. But anyway, enough about me. This is supposed to be about the haul. So I'm very happy with my items. I love the rice bowls. I'll definitely use those. I'll give my mom the pink glass and I will, um, I think a lot of the other stuff I might end up just giving away. It was just fun to collect that and it was neat. But, um, so yeah, that was it. That was the haul for today. Thanks for watching. Thanks for joining. And I'll see you again next time. Hopefully I'll have my thoughts more. <laughs> All right. Bye.